what once seemed unthinkable has now thundered into reality. An American space agency, after decades of denying India the crown jewel of rocket technology, entrusted the world's most expensive Earth monitoring satellite to the very engines they tried to stop. Watch this next report from Weon's Siddharth MP, who reports from Sri Harikota, where NISA satellite was launched into orbit. The very atmosphere vibrated with the raw power of India's GSLV rocket as it ascended, carrying the Nisar satellite. It is the world's most expensive civilian Earth imaging satellite. India's indigenously built GSLV Mark II rocket lifted off its cryogenic core, blazing into the sky with NASA's most expensive Earth science satellite on board. School children brought to watch the launch and mission teams erupted in cheers. NISAR, which stands for NASA ISRO Synthetic Aperture Radar, a cutting-edge satellite designed to scan Earth's surface with pinpoint radar precision, has entered orbit riding on technology America once refused to sell India. NISAR will be our planet's ultimate sentinel, scanning every inch of Earth's land and ice with dual-frequency radar, from mapping earthquakes tracking disasters and monitoring crop health to understanding shifting glaciers and rising seas. Nisar's eye is unmatched. For both NASA and ISRO, this is a massive success. For the NISAR satellite particularly, this is a beginning of its three to five year long life in space. NISAR will serve as a health monitor for the Earth. It will map the entire Earth's surface, including the land surface and the Earth's ice mass. This will be done every week and with every passing week, the imagery of the Earth can be compared and even centimeter level changes on Earth's surface can be studied. This data is available for the whole world. Anyone who is dealing with Earth science or any civilian can download it and try to interpret this data and use it to develop the learnings with regards Earth sciences. Equipped with a 12-meter dish that will unfold in space, Nisar will record nearly all of Earth's land and ice twice every 12 days from an altitude of 747 kilometers. The mission has been hailed as a milestone in growing U.S.-India cooperation between President Donald Trump and Prime Minister Narendra Modi.